I'll get straight to the point. What business did you have with... What's mine? <laughs> I don't care. I don't care that you just wanted to ask something at first. You touched something of mine. And I don't like it when somebody touches my things. If you want to keep those hands of yours, you better keep them to yourself. <laughs> Otherwise, <laughs> you're going to lose them. Finger by finger. One by one. <sighs> Don't think that I'm just playing around. If I hadn't caught you alone. No. <laughs> if I had caught you alone. You wouldn't be getting off this easy. You can be glad that I'm in company. <laughs> no need to get so cocky. I might as well change my mind. See that? That's my favorite butterfly knife. I have it on me at all times. I just thought you might want to see. Get a little glimpse of that beauty. Get a little idea of what I am capable of doing. Now piss off before I change my mind. Now. Are you alright? Why are you smiling like that? Huh? <laughs> Don't bullshit me. Something's up. What is it? Don't tell me. You've enjoyed the show? <laughs> Don't think I was kidding. I meant that dead serious. You know I'm not bullshitting around. Especially not when it's about something as important as you. <laughs> You've told me that times and times before. <laughs> as if I would get caught. Have a little bit more faith in me, would you? After all, I've told you about all the things that went down in the past. I haven't got caught even once. Never. I'm too good for them to catch me. <laughs> they might think they have a chance, but they don't. I like to make them think that they do, but only makes their cries even more enjoyable. <laughs> oh. oh no, that's not a problem. You wouldn't dare to tell anyone. I'll make absolutely sure of that. No, I'm not going to do anything to him that involves physical harm, okay? I can promise you that. At least as long as he get his grippers away from you and anything else as well. Then he's pretty much safe and okay. But if he ever dares to bother you again, no matter in what way or form, He's done for. He is absolutely and completely done for. I will have no mercy. I know what I'm doing, okay? I 
And here I thought I was the one being worried about you and not the other way around. There's definitely no need for you to worry about me. I can take care of myself, you know? In comparison to you, I mean, I do know that you can take care of yourself as well, but I'm the better caretaker. And I told you what to do if anybody is bothering you. Oh, you can just repeat that. Tell me what I told you. What are you supposed to do when somebody won't leave you alone? That's right. You come to me. No matter what time it is, no matter what day. You're going to inform me and I'm going to take care of the situation. That taking care of can of course look different in each case, but I told you before that I would protect you and that I wouldn't let anyone else lay a finger on you or insult you know you in any sort of way. Yes, yes. I will stop. I think we've went over the most important parts, right? Now. Uh, no, I will not seek them out right now. I've got other things to do, right? So, what do you say? How does lunch sound, hmm? Just you and me together at one of these calm little restaurants around the corner where nobody's going to bother us. <laughs> well, I'm glad that you like the idea then. <sighs> oh, no, don't you worry. I'm calm. Just, it just keeps going through my mind that he actually had the audacity, that he had the fucking audacity. No, no, I know, I know. You don't need to remind me. It's okay. I can deal with it. Maybe I just need my sweetheart to distract me a little bit. I'm sure you can think of something. But first, let's go and grab some lunch. <sighs> this has been going on for too long anyways, and the day is already past. I'm exhausted. <sighs> Alright, let's go then. If you still got something to grab, I'll meet you outside. See you in just a moment.